the channel. Right, what we are doing here, another project that we're starting, um, and I'm trying to get ahead of the game a little bit here. We've got a load of kitchen alterations, some walls to come out, uh, bolted ceiling and all the rest of it, but today we are changing this little beauty. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna put a new RCBO board on, um, test all the house out. Now what I've done, because everyone is doing Zoom meetings and all the rest of it, I've rigged up a little temporary board, okay? So that's all ready to go. So then that runs out for a uh, lead to connect to the Wi-Fi because it's, it's so important now for people that are working from home to be able to have access to the internet at all times. So that's what we're doing. So yeah, so in here, let's take the cover off together. It is completely dead, obviously, because there is no connection whatsoever. Um, so this is, this is what we're at. So as you can see in there, she's a bit of a mess. It's had lots of additions and all sorts of stuff by all accounts. We've got some nice bits of twisty in there, lot. And also, you see that where they've cut that sheathing off? They've gone all the way through. Look at that. That's pretty piss poor, that is, isn't it? Let's be honest. Uh, more twisties. So looking like we got lots of fun going on. Now the alarm is going off because she is an old alarm. Never gets used. So power's off. Alarm's kicking its head off now. Um, so, well... We'll have to get some ladders out and stop that at some point, I reckon, because I don't. I think we'll have to decommission it because I don't think they're, they're going to reuse that anyway. So what I'll do is I'll get this stripped out and we will... Um, I'll set you off a time-lapse while I'm stripping it all out and then I'll catch up with you once I've got that all out of the way. circuit in like the dining area in there and then they've brought it up to this bit and extended it now that lower one's this one here and then that runs up this way so what I'm going to do I'm going to unpick that you see how close that is to that drill that red raw plug there so what I'm going to do I'm going to unpick that and find out actually where it goes whether it loops back up and it goes up into here, look, because someone's already chiseled that out. I'm not entirely sure, so I'll just make sure that that's not damaged, and I think that's where it is, because I need to make sure, obviously, when I fit the new board, when it goes on there, that that's not going to get caught. So, but yeah, so, if you, like I say, if you like the channel, um, don't forget to subscribe, because it massively helps um, keep the channel, channel growing. Uh, we've got more content coming out now because we've got uh, additional cameras and stuff like that now. So the lads are doing, they're going to be filming more of the building work um, than, than I am, to be fair. Uh, I'm going to be doing mainly all the electrical work and plumbing and stuff like that. So like I say, there's loads and more content coming. Now the other lads you see, they're very, very new to it. It's usually 
my ugly mug that's uh, on this all the time. So um, it's quite entertaining watching them doing the recording. Um, so yeah, so like I say, if you have already subscribed, thank you very much. It's uh, so it's massive for, for me personally that you've uh, subscribed. So, but yeah, so that's uh, a little message from me to you guys. Thank you very much. Um, but yeah, so I'll unpick that and then I will catch up with you. Want to know a bit more about what's going on there? Right, they've really done a number on this one. So yes, it did get caught on that red raw plug there. Look, you see that. And also, when you come a bit further back, oh, just for good measure, we'll stick a brown through it as well. So, you see that? So, that's a classic case of, yeah, whatever, we'll just turn the breaker back on. And, it, oh, it's come back on, fine, happy days, and nothing wrong with it. That didn't really happen. Um, so, what I'm going to do, I think, because that one does look like it's going to go up to that there. So, what I'm going to do is... Blind panic now, honestly. No, what I'm going to do is I'm going to drop this down, uh, run it along here somewhere, put it in an adaptable box there, and then bring the legs up properly, uh, and then try and get rid of all this. I'll have to put another connector up there, I think, on the, above there. So yeah, so this is a good start, isn't it? Right, so we've got the board all mounted up there's been a bit of a change of plan because because of that damage on the cable down here i thought you know what sod it all the cables come up from this way so i've lifted the board above the shelf what was there took that off like i say we've got loads of work here to do so all this has just crumbled off so we'll we'll re-plaster all that when we're back in a, literally like a week's time um so what i've done is got the board up i've mounted it on some uh, some spacers Brought all the cables in from behind here, um, put a bit of trunking on just to neaten that up. Um, so what I've done, well, what I'm going to do now, put all my RCBOs in. So I'll dress all these in now, get all these going. The alarm's still screaming its nuts off considering it's really old. I'm surprised it's still going, um, to be honest. So I'm going to have to sort that out at some stage because it's driving me mental, let alone any of the neighbours. So, so yeah, so I just thought I'd give you a bit of an update on where we're at. So what I'll do, I'll set you up on time lapse just while I uh, address all these in. Um, but yeah, I mean, I get these boards from uh, Gilleck. Um, absolutely, like I said, I'm not paid to say this, but I just use all, get all my boards there from uh, from Gilleck now. Um, George sorts me out on a good price to be fair and when you're comparing these to the Hager board on prices it's just non-comparison really um really like the fuse box brand um the service from them uh from Gilleck is brilliant as well it's literally as long as it's in stock it's next day um which is happy days is what you want so like I say I'll get this all um all bedded in now and then I'll start ripping around and doing all the testing Right, so that's all the board <coughs> all put in uh, and all stripped sorry so what we're going to do now i'll go around the house test everything make sure everything's all good um luckily enough the neighbor uh, had a massive set of ladders so i've just been outside and borrowed those disconnected the bell outside because that was driving everybody mental it saves me going home to get mine so yeah so what i'll do is i'll 
go around the house, test everything up, and then I'll catch up with you once I've done all my testing, uh, and I'll go through all the results and everything with you. And if there's fingers crossed, there's no issues because I don't want any issues. I just want to, you know, a nice straightforward job for once would be nice. So yeah, so I'll catch up with you once I've done all my testing. Right, that's where we've got to at the minute. So board's all in. Still don't know what that one does. Um, so it's all tested out now. That is the upstairs lights, and I've got no continuity with CPC. So we're back in a, literally in a matter of days. So what we've said we're going to do is come back. We'll do the fault finding on there. Um, we've got some bonding and stuff like that to to put in to sort all this out. But we are we're taking all this out and uh, we're redoing all the kitchen. Uh, let me show you. So all this ceiling up here, you see, is going to be up and vaulted. So this, all this kitchen area is all, all going to be taken out and redone. So it kind of, there's no point getting too involved in it at the minute. Um, so there's a window and stuff that's being altered over there. Um, so yeah, so there's loads, loads to do. So what I've said is I might as well sort those bits out um, when I come back. Uh, it's like I say, it's a matter of days. So so yeah, so. Like I say, I'll catch up with you once we've, we're back in a few days. But like I say, thanks for watching. Um, if you have subscribed, thank you very much. If you haven't, links in the corner as usual. And I shall catch you on the next one. Cheers, guys.